start doing. She's got this for a birdie. Yeah. Well, we're used to seeing that. When she gets the putter going, she goes low. She really does. And, uh, you know, they're inspiring the next generation and, and Swedish golf really, really strong as we see Lynn Grant there playing her second. And what a good shot that is. Just in the slope, you can see that slope, the green slopes, the fairway slopes, and what a fabulous shot by Lynn Grant. And she suddenly got going. Probably only have eyes for the flag, Grant. Downhill par three. Well, she went, oh, oh no. Yeah, it's terrible, isn't it? It's a good six feet. Yeah. Just like that, Lynn Grant, six under for her last six holes. I was a little concerned. That's all right. That's all right. <laughs> Lynn Grant, is it going to be another birdie opportunity set up? Be surprised if it wasn't. We're almost <laughs> almost just the par for the co-leader. Now where will she be that all her wins have come? Right at the start of this back nine. Same bunker. Co leaders Lynn Grant. 146 yards, but it won't play that long. That was dead on line. Oh, I think she thought she had that. And everybody was playing the lights. Par four. And you get the feeling that uh, Lynn Grant and uh, Leanne Pace are having a lovely round. Almost as if they're two friends out playing a game of golf. Oh, that's a fantastic shot as well. up the tree was a case in point as we watch Lynn Grant here. It's tidy enough, but not guaranteed. Yeah, it, it was just so firmly, boldly struck. Well, her three previous wins have come from her leading going into the final round or being in a share of the lead. And that's what she is right now, co-leader alongside Anna Palife at the top. Although, uh, worth mentioning, Alina Numenpa is only at the start of her round and only one back, but that is...